And we are off. Marcus Joseph and Gogolim kicking off with Andre Etienne instantly trying a long diagonal pass. And it is a throw in for Gogolim inside Churchill territory. Perhaps Churchill do have a slight advantage with Primus and Abu Bakr, but Pona comes in. Uh, that's a chance there, but eventually cleared away by Pone Faz. It was a bit of a chance. Garcia cleared away this time. First post, Garcia again. Ball comes in. Andre Etienne. And he hits the side netting. In hindsight, he should have perhaps squared the ball to a better, better player in that sense. He's not well known for his finishing. Although in that situation, truth be told, I myself would have tried to finish. In turn, part of the ball to Nathaniel Garcia. Leaves <laughs> Juan Gomez on his backside there. Beautiful play there. This time by Sebastian. Marcus Joseph. Well blocked there by Pony Faz. But beautiful football by Nathaniel Garcia. Here comes Nathaniel Garcia. Looking for Henry Kiseka. A chance! Oh, and Kiseka manages to squirm the ball just wide. And Primus is giving Mondal a huge bollocking over there. Where on earth was the keeper going? He was trying to imitate Ubaid last week in Punjab. The goalkeeper went fishing here. Juan Gomez. Oh, Cisse with a shot. Good save there by Ubaid. A save you would expect a keeper of his caliber and experience to make comfortably. It's a corner kick now for Churchill Brothers. With around 10 minutes left of this first half. That is the first shot on target for the Goans. Garcia looking for Amiri. That was a very poor ball there from Arun Amiri. But now it's Marcus Joseph and it's a goal! Marcus Joseph! The first clear cut chance he has and he runs over to celebrate wildly with the fans. And it's Gokulam Kerala 1, Churchill Brothers nil. A weight off the shoulders of Fernando Santiago Varela and his Gokulam side who have played the better football who have shown the better quality in this game so far. Instant reply. It's a good ball there from Sangwan. Looking. It's a chance. It's a corner kick. Ubay managed to thwart Primus's. But it was a mistake at the back post there. I think it was. I think, yep, yeah, it was Amiri. And it was a good save at the end from Ubay. Kiseka looking for Joseph this is a chance again Marcus Joseph what can he produce side netting this time Marcus Joseph with the side netting but Gokulam they are playing very well when they get the ball at feet to players like Joseph to players like Kiseka to players like Garcia as we can see Primus is down injured. This is the last thing that Tavares and Churchill need. Another injury. They have so many players out. TNT. Garcia. Shots. Easy enough save from Mondal. And the referee blows for the half time whistle here in the EMS Stadium in Calicut. It's a fantastic occasion. Just remember that all the proceedings from the game. All the entrance fees will be gifted, donated to Dhananraj and his family. The Gokulam win today would put them with 13 points with the game in hand over Mohun Bagan who have 20. So they could potentially go just four points behind the Mariners. Churchill Brothers though will remain with 10 points. Two games in hand. Ball into the box. Cleared by Mohammed al -Shahid. Playing it to Amir. Looking for Nathaniel Garcia. Garcia with space to run into. 
Garcia with a shot. Hits the side netting there, but that's just a glimpse of what Nathaniel Garcia can produce. The Punjabi team. That is a free kick there. He's a bit clumsy from Nathaniel Garcia on Khalifa Hassan. Didn't really need to be doing that. Sebastian was there covering him. So it would back to Sebastian. Ball in, it's a chance, and Marcus Joseph again. Let's not forget both of these teams have come from suffering defeats. Wokulam suffering a defeat against Punjab. And good ball there. Penalty kick has to be a penalty kick. Is it going to be? No, it isn't. It's going to be a goal kick. Abu Bakr is signaling that Joseph dies. And well, we cannot really make clear assumptions watching. Determined to try and get his compatriot picked for diving. Juan Gomez with the ball into the box. That's a good ball into the box. It's a chance here. Churchill Brothers. Sokrates saved by Ubaid. But what is the goalkeeper doing? That's not his job. Eventually cleared away. He slows the game down. Brilliant ball. Henry Kiseka is offside. But the major talking point there was Sokrates with a brilliant chance. Ubaid is now on the floor. He always seems to be injured after... Daniel Garcia for Marcus Joseph. Good chance here for Joseph. Joseph, Joseph, Joseph. Hits the side netting. Marcus Joseph, the danger man once again. This time inches away from making it 2-0. Literally scraped the post as it went by. Churchill. Oh, that was a brilliant chance there for Churchill Brothers, and I think it was Abu Bakr. The corner. It's a good ball in. Gurung looking for Cisse. Ubay does not take any chances and gifts Churchill Brothers yet another corner. That's four corners in a row. And the pressure is mounting on Ubay and on the 11 Gokula men on the field. Throwing now, which Israel Gurung duly takes. Looking for Khalifa Hassan. Gurung again. Ball into the box. Looking for Sise. Abu Bakr. That is a dangerous situation there. Let's not forget, Abu Bakr has already been booked in the first half. You have seen yellows given for something like this. Abu Bakr again. And it looks like. Abu Bakr is being sent off and he is Radhanfar Abu Bakr has been sent off for Churchill Brothers perhaps it was not the foul but the remonstrations after he has been remonstrating time and time again today the ball has got now with Marcus Joseph it's two against two Joseph looking for Shebel good goalkeeping there from Mondal all to play for in the Hero I League as the referee blows for the final whistle here in Calicut in the EMS Stadium. A priceless victory for the Malabarians, Gokul and Kerala, coming courtesy of Marcus Joseph. There is nothing that Churchill Brothers could do in the game today. The fans absolutely...